Well, today I got a question about Ubuntu Linux, so I'm going to read it. Simon to Geek, I need help. I do not understand how to install applications on Ubuntu. I know how to add and remove programs thing, but I don't know how to install applications that are not listed on that. Thanks. Hey, guys, this is Simon the Geek. This is just, here's part of the response to... AJ, he wanted to know how to install programs in the new Ubuntu. And um, here's, keep in mind that Ubuntu is a Debian based Linux, so use the .deb format when installing stuff. Basically, you, you install it like any other app you would on a, on a closed source operating system. As you can see, Ubuntu has, you know, made their own wizard. You no longer have to do terminal commands. You just do it just like you would on a Mac. You type in your password. And voila. It starts installing it. You can still use the terminal and see what's going on if you want. It's kind of froze there a little bit. Because accessing the terminal while it's trying to do something is pretty hefty. As you can see, you're reading database. But you don't have to type it in all yourself. It does it for you. That's basically how you install things on new Ubuntu. If you really want to do the terminal like you would in other ones, just download a GTK file and do it there. But if you don't, you just click the dev file and see it installs it itself. And for all those who want to know how to do Windows program installs, let me just click pivot here and put in the trash. Now that pivot's gone. This is the Windows pivot program. A lot of people on YouTube use it. <coughs> I'm sorry, did I say something? Alright, um, you just go to the setup exe, download this application called Wine. As you can see, Wine has a programs list like any Windows start bar would. As you can see with Wine I have installed on my Ubuntu machine QuickTime, iTunes, and Photoshop Elements. So what I want to do here is I click setup.exe it opens up the thing, the application and I can basically open it that's basically how you do it. You do it like, and then after you click that, it pulls up a Windows installer, and you install it like that. The way to configure Wine is you go to the Wine configuration, and here, say you want a specific version of Windows to run on this Wine. It's not coming up for a reason. Here, let me close some stuff. Alright, you go into configure wine and down here at the bottom it says Windows XP. You click this. See, you can go Windows 95, 98, ME, 2000, and 2003, Vista. And 2008 is a server and so is 2003 if you don't know what Windows, what those windows mean. You can go to Vista. Applications will work except for Vista 64-bit applications. It will not work in Wine at all. 64-bit will not work in Wine. Just keep that in mind. And there's how you basically install stuff in the new Ubuntu.